Welcome back, Midweek Wine. This episode I'm calling Breaking the Rules with Great Results. Every appellation in Europe has its rules, um, yields uh, and so on and some of the, any other things, but the main thing is about which grapes you're allowed to grow. Does that mean if a winemaker or a grape grower wants to grow something different, he can't? Not at all. It just means that he can't use those grapes in a wine that has the name of the appellation on it. So, for example, I'm sure many of you have seen Vin de Pays d'Oc. Vin de Pays, or country wine, is what the French used to call, and still call to a certain degree, wines that are outside of the rules of the appellation. Soon you will start seeing IGP, Indication Geographique Protégée, which means exactly the same thing. Are these wines better or worse? It doesn't matter. They're good if the winemaker is good. We have a perfect example here of a Vin de Pays d'Oc from Duperé Barrera, 2014 Terre de Méditerranée. Combines the long duck grapes, Grenache, Syrah, Carignan, with the outsider, Cabernet Sauvignon. Why it's called Vin de Pays. What's it taste like? Has all that ripe fruit that you expect from a southern wine, but with a little bit more finesse, a little bit more elegance that comes from the Cabernet tannins. How much is this one? $15.55. Can't go wrong. Tête de Méditerranée, Vendée Pays d'Oc, long live the rule breakers. Talk to you next week.